Uh, good morning, and uh, very glad to be here and, uh, and give you the industry view of, uh, of this Horizon 2020 and what, is, what we can create here in Europe. Uh, I'm coming from Kone. Uh, Kone is a Finnish uh, company, uh, but uh, uh, globally based, and uh, we have uh, our research center all over the world. Europe is the main, but uh, of course we have uh, also Asian uh, R&D centers. And uh, as mentioned before, uh, innovation is coming as well uh, from there. We have a vision in, in Kone. Our vision is to provide the best people flow. And uh, I will try with uh, with my presentation to link this uh, vision with what Europe could play and where Europe could play a big uh, role in this, uh, in, this, uh, in this vision. This percentage represents the uh, total uh, volume of elevator escalator that are today uh, present uh, in the world. So we have uh, around uh, 11 million of equipment in, uh, in the world, and 51% are based in Europe. Clearly, uh, North America, South America, and as well Asia are playing a big role into the uh, growing but the base uh, of, uh, of uh, our equipment is in Europe. Some predecessor here uh, mentioned about the societal uh, changes. Uh, what we are looking as, as, a, as a mega trend uh, are very clearly linked. And we have uh, aging population, we have safety, safety uh, that need to grow, and uh, there is a need of safety and of course, eco-efficiency, sustainability. How we can, uh, how we can turn uh, this in, into uh, a renewal of our industry? Kone is, is known as an industry-leading company and recognized as a innova for uh, its innovations. As I said, mentioned before, Kune is committed to offer innovation, people, innovation through people flow and solution to make uh, this uh, uh, traveling between building uh, possible and in a smooth way. I have put here a short uh, timeline uh, that is starting in 96. Uh, why 96? 96 is the date when uh, Kone introduced and revolutionized this uh, uh, industry, introducing a completely new uh, concept in the industry. I I'm not uh, now going into the details of the innovation, but uh, why I want to put uh, all the innovation uh, here in this timeline uh, up to today is because most of uh, those innovations are related to modernization. Modernization is something that we can uh, boost based on, on, on what I showed before and made, based on the picture that I mentioned before. 51% of equipment are based in Europe. And based on the fact that we need to improve eco-efficiency, we need to uh, create uh, safety uh, more and more than uh, what it was before. And we have this uh, uh, mega trend of age population. This is going to boost uh, this industry specifically in Europe because modernization, replacement of all the equipment is creating this demand. What, uh, what is the, the, the way of, uh, of, uh, of innovation and ideas? that we see from our perspective. What I'm here mentioning as a past is nothing related to that need to be changed or whipped out. This is a, a base uh, where we are building our future. And uh, we are having 
in the past innovation contest. Patenting, it's still a very high level activity. Basic research, something that we cannot uh, avoid. We, we need research. And the, the networking was in ex for, with the external world was limited with selected partners, and may be more, most probably in the vicinity industry. What we are going in the future, and what we are doing already, is that innovation should come through partner, customer, and something that is very uh, typical for us is users. Uh, many of you, or most probably everybody of you, using elevator, escalator, and as well building doors, uh, coming into building as this one. And that is where we can capture the innovation. Specifically in the country where these, uh, uh, these mega trends are, are boosting our needs. Open innovation is something that uh, we are using very much in these days. And, and uh, with external world, with other companies. Uh, we have been discussing here earlier about uh, aviation. It's, we are moving people as well, and we, we can see a lot of synergies. I put it a, an example as a FEMEC that is a, a, a consortium uh, happening in, uh, in, in Finland where we can have all the different company uh, creating innovation. We are also together with the academic world building these uh, innovation labs. Innovation labs is something that we truly need because uh, uh, in these labs we can experience our users' uh, feedback and inputs. Idea generation is something that uh, it's happening everywhere and internally, externally of our industry and our own uh, fields. I have here listed the way how to make this happen, how to create these future innovations. We need structural changes. And to create uh, these structural changes, we need to cluster and, uh, and create a uh, uh, right uh, partner or partnership during the whole innovation phases. We know that through an inno in the innovation, we have different phases and uh, starting from the basic research to the development of products and to the industrialization. Through the different phases, we can create different partnership and get the best out of, uh, of this partnership. I have seen mentioned also several times the speed. Speed is something that uh, is needed not to make things faster, but to increase the speed of, uh, of what, what we are doing. We know that uh, uh, the world is changing. The needs of, uh, of creating new solutions is, uh, is very high in the agenda of everybody. So the speed to make the changes and to create these trends and to answer to this trend is something very important. We need to faster and widely create this partnership. It's something that uh, in Kone, we, we truly believe that this is, the, this is the way. How we are building and how we are creating the understanding of this people flow. Uh, how a company can contribute uh, successfully to urban development. And when I was saying uh, before with customer and user, uh, it's, really, it's really the way that we are able to create uh, uh, this uh, urban development. Urban means all the cities, urbanization needs. As well in Europe, even if the industry of construction is not in the boosting phase, we have a lot of infrastructure that are renewed, a lot of uh, public buildings that uh, are changing the, the, the usage. So, this people flow is something that uh, could really create uh, uh, something different and something that could boost our industry more. Understanding the cycle of buildings. Buildings are changing. Buildings need to be renewed. Uh, 
building of different needs uh, during their life. And this is something that needs to be understood together with the public sector, together with investors. Understanding our customer challenges uh, is not something that we can build alone, but we need to understand the challenges of our customer and help uh, the, the, those challenges to be answered. In technology, our approach is related to people flow. And everything that we are doing guides us there. As I mentioned and summarizing, collaborating closely with customer, user, and partners, enable customer and user-driven innovation. Creating the best available elevator, escalator, and automatic building door technology as a foundation of innovation people flow solution. Utilizing the last technology, and this is something very important here, together with efficient process and state of the art, together with partnering, together with the university, together with institutes, and together with public uh, funding. This is enabling us to boost this industry, specifically in Europe. Hone is manufacturing the products uh, together with uh, our partner. And we strongly believe that the manufacturing of people flow solution is something that could be beneficial for Europe as well. How I want to summarize in my last uh, slide how we are creating this boosting in our industry. We need to know what we are looking for and we can show our interest of, uh, of, of emerging needs. We need to have more idea, we need to have more mind and we need to have different mind. Uh, this diversified uh, boosting, it's very important. We need to work with all the industry, with all the possible uh, customer needs and with public. We need to change the perspective. That is something that will always boost our industry. We need to change our perspective. We do not have to look our product as product, but we need to look our product as a solution and how those solutions are enabling our industry boosting. One important thing is that to create this, we need talents, and talents uh, that uh, are available to work with this kind of uh, solutions and with this kind of vision. So, this is my way of seeing this uh, people flow boosting in European contest. <laughs>